my name is sam dani shekran and welcome to this database lessons video series in this video we are going to take a look into how we can download oracle database software from oracle's website to do that you have to go to oracle.com and you need to sign in okay if you don't have an account you can sign up for a free account okay right now i'm going to sign in okay i've signed in then i need to go to downloads in downloads i am going to download the database software so i click database and oracle database 12c is the one that i'm going to install in this windows 8.1 pc so oracle 12c and you need to accept the license agreement okay it's by default it's in accept but for some reason if you click you know it might say accept see okay i chose uh, i disable the accept and then i re-enabled it okay so now if i click file 1 okay it's going to ask ask me do you want to save okay click save okay that's going to save this to your download folder i've already saved a copy of that so i'm going to cancel this if you notice it's saving the file as the file name with the uh, parenthesis 1 that means there is already a file called a database 1 of 2 so i'm going to cancel this okay and i need to download file 2 also okay if you click that you would be able to save the file okay i'm going to cancel this because i've already downloaded it okay and uh, for a demonstration purpose i am planning to install oracle 11 also in this pc so i have downloaded microsoft windows 64 bit version for oracle 11g release 2 file 1 and file 2 i've already downloaded them okay and once you download all these files by default will go to downloads folder okay let me put this in focus okay in this pc there is a downloads folder so that is what you will have in your windows 8.1 pc and these are the files i downloaded okay oracle 12c 1 of 2 oracle 12c 2 of 2 and uh, this is the one which i uh, actually i've already downloaded uh, uh, another copy i don't need that so i'm going to delete that okay i have for 11g release 2 1 of 2 2 of 2 okay so these files are compressed files meaning that they have lot of files within them so i need to extract those files into a folder before installing oracle so to do that first you know um, do a right click on the file which is one of two and then choose extract all okay so if you do that it's going to ask to where you want to extract okay instead of extracting it to Uh, a, a folder called you know tolsi database one of two you know what i did was i created a common folder called uh, uh, tolsi database and that is where i extracted the first file so you choose this folder and then you click extract i don't i'm not going to click extract because i've already extracted it okay so once you click extract it will be extracting all the files to this folder okay so once it is done then you would need to extract the second file so i'm going to click cancel here because i have already extracted it so now i'm going to extract the second file the important thing here to note is you need to extract this file into the same folder where you have extracted file 1 okay that's very important 
the the thing is oracle has divided the installation files into two compressed files and when we extract those two files we need to put them back into a same location okay that's very important so for second file again choose this and click extract and that will extract the files from the second compressed file and so once it is done this is where i extracted this folder is the place where i extracted so once it is done when when you go to that folder there will be a folder called database and if you go inside there will be these files and i'm going to use setup.exe to install oracle 12c in windows 8.1 thank you for watching